What is up YouTube? This is Ronnie of UnlimitedCellPhonePlan.com and today we're taking a closer look at the ZTE score for Cricut Wireless. This is their Move Muse enabled uh, entry level Android handset. Uh, it's got a uh, matte black uh, around the edges here. Uh, it's got glossy black uh, around the bezel of the front here. Uh, also gets those lovely fingerprints that I enjoy so much. Uh, the, the back here is that glossy black that is very fingerprinty as well. Uh, it's got a circle, a little stylish circle here around the 3.5 megapixel camera in back. A speaker down below. Uh, here is one big issue with the phone. It's got, um, you have to pop this open with the fingernail to get to the micro USB uh, to charge, which could be a struggle after a long night out. So, popped it open there finally, and now I can, I'm ready to charge with my micro USB. So, that is one little downfall of this entry level handset, in my opinion. Um, then we've got a quick camera access button here on the side, which I'll show you in a little bit. Uh, the micro SD access port here, which is well protected, which is a good thing. The volume rockers for volume up, volume down. Up top, we've got the uh, 3.5 millimeter headphone jack and the lock unlock button. So being a entry level Android handset, I do find this is a really functional phone. The other cool thing is that it's Move Music enabled, which means you can get their unlimited plan. You, although it does show earphones here on the front of the box, it doesn't come with them, which is kind of disappointing, but um, go get your own. I use uh, ZipBuds at ZipBuds.com. They have um, the zipper and the earphones so they don't get all tangled like these ones do. I showed them in previous videos. Check them out if you're interested. Uh, dive right into the Angry Birds test here. So. Um, I cheated and I preloaded it because it was taking about a full minute to load um, the Angry Birds here. But once you get it going, it runs super smooth. So as you can see, Angry Birds works great for an entry level handset here. Um, try out another game here, Rollerball. So we got Rollerball coming up. All right, again, preloaded this one just to give you a quick demo of what another game's like on here. Runs really smooth, really responsive. Good, great, grand. Then we've got Facebook for all of you Facebook nerds out there, which all of you are. And, um, you know, it works really smooth. This is uh, the one direct from the Android market. It's not the uh, ZTE one or the Cricket one. Uh, this is the actual one from the... Um, from the the Android market and it works great on here and we can zoom in we can zoom out we can go back we can scroll through the friend list we can see our old video here from the Huawei Mercury review that we did uh, it's gonna load directly into YouTube as Facebook does and speaking of which, why don't we dive right into a YouTube test. So as it loads the video here on the Cricut 3G network, um, let's... What is up, YouTube? This is Ronnie of UnlimitedCellPhonePlan.com, and today we're taking a closer look at the Huawei Mercury smartphone for Cricut Wireless. So that's pretty cool. That's loaded within the Facebook app. So if we wanted to do an actual YouTube test, we should go to the YouTube app that comes included with the cell phone. So let's load it up here. Let's do a search. Let's go for the Huawei Mercury. Once again, this is all on the Cricut 3G network. This is not on Wi-Fi. Uh, let's find our review here, the one that we were just watching on Facebook. But you know what? We decided that Facebook didn't have the high quality oh, button, YouTube, so we wanted to itself. load it in the YouTube app so we can watch in high quality on this entry-level Android handset. So it's loading right now, and let's see how long it takes on the... Well, oh, there it is. So... Not bad for a 3.5 inch HVGA display. Uh, volume gets reasonably loud. And yeah, passes the YouTube test with flying colors. Uh, we got Twitter here. Of course, for all your tweeting needs. Uh, let's check out what Pete Cashmore of Mashable is saying right now. 
All right, saw what he said. Let's check out some other stuff. Scroll back and forth. Check out CNET News, of course. As you can see, it works pretty darn good. Uh, one thing I didn't like about the phone is the mini keyboard here. So it's not your usual uh, Android keyboard. It's kind of a ZTE proprietary one. Uh, so I would recommend replacing this because it's just not as quick to respond as um, some of the other Android keyboards are available even for free uh, in the Android market. Uh, let's do a quick browser test for you. I'm not gonna not gonna bother getting um, getting the iPhone out to compare because it's not fair against a, a entry level one. Uh, but it does do reasonably well for being what it is, a affordable Android handset. So we're loading uh, Gizmodo up here real quick. And here it comes, all right, maybe not. Uh, isn't that fun? There it is, all right. So now you see why it wouldn't have been fair for me to, to race this against the iPhone 4S. Uh, like most things on this phone, once it gets going, it's good to go, but uh, sometimes things take a little bit to get going on this phone. And if you don't want to wait that long, maybe look for a, uh, a higher-end Android handset available from uh, Cricut, maybe the Huawei Mercury. Maybe some of Samsung's offerings, I don't know. Anyways, uh, let's check out the 3.5 megapixel camera real quick, and then we will wrap it up. So I took some pictures earlier. Um, this one I took using the quick camera access button here on the side. And let me show you a quick video I filmed here of um, a bathroom getting remodeled. So uh, it is a decent camcorder, but uh, nothing great about it. It is extremely sensitive to light changes. And um, as you can see from this video, just not the world's greatest camcorder that's ever been on a cell phone. So that's it, guys. This is the ZTE score for Cricut Wireless. Please leave your questions in the comments section. I'll do my best to answer them. Uh, please subscribe. And once again, this is Ronnie from UnlimitedCellPhonePlan.com, and this is the ZTE score for Cricut Wireless. Thanks, everyone.